We have to find her. Help me look. Of course. Kate! 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 Call out to me! Whoa, what happened with that? What's going on with those horses? Kate! What kind of witchcraft is this? Take me down to where my stars are shining All around me like halogen Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Walking Dead. Last time David freaked out on us and stole Gabe and Kate and Clementine are going to go and save that town while we are going to go and try to save Gabe. I have two predictions. One is it's going to be a very short episode because I did kind of stop towards the end. Two, that uh, someone's going to die because Telltale has already proven to me numerous times, <coughs> Lee, that there is no happy endings in this game. Maybe there will be. Maybe this will be like the turnaround. If, but you know, I'd be a little disappointed if suddenly there was a happy ending. I don't know. I feel like Dave was gonna die. The guys who freak out always die. Isn't that how it is? I don't know. I also noticed there's this feature down here called crowd play. And what is crowd play? And I thought it was really cool. You guys could pick the choices or pick your top choices. That's really cool for streamers. I'm glad they put that in there. Let's get started, shall we? Had something on my keyboard. Ugh. Don't know what it was. And hopefully we start right back where we were last. I haven't played this game at all since I first played it last week. Oh. Oh. Intense music. Heart pumping already. Let's do this. Get him, Javi. I was going to call him Javier and then I was like, Javi. <laughs> Avoid him. Find them. Slay your brother. I forgot your brother beat the shit out of your face. Don't slow down, Havy. That's gotta be David's work. What you mean driving? <laughs> leaving the trailer road, kill brother. Should lead me right to you. This has to be David. Nothing but bodies. <laughs> to the left, to the left. Don't even bother. Just that was kind of a cool effect. I'm not gonna lie. Hi, Jeff. Oh, bye, Jeff. To the left, to the left, or to the right. That's the left. To your left. Follow that trail. <laughs> Loaded for a cutscene, and now loading again. No. Oh. They're not in there, Javi. Oh. Maybe they are in there, Javi. Hang on, Gabe! Oh, Q, 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 Q. This is a suicide mission, Javi. You can't possibly take them all. What, what did you hit? Nothing? I'm very confused by that. We gotta get to them, but how are they fighting inside the truck unless they're not inside the truck? I am very confused. Kick them where it hurts. Yeah. And again. Double tap. Oh, behind you. Oh, ow. Damn. Ugh. That made my ears ring, not because there's ringing. Hang on, Gabe. Hey, better, better, better. I feel like after this, Gabe has to get bit, right? Not Gabe. Javi. Javi has to get bit, right? That's right. You focus on me. Oh, come on. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yeah, get their attention. He's getting tired. There's no way he can keep this up. And I'm sorry, but the other zombie's not dead. They just get back up. Hey, good looking. What's cooking? I almost did not press Q, I was pressing A. Too busy giving her compliments. Bobby, is that you? Help! Get the back off me! Hold on, Gabe! We got gas! Oh, he definitely got bit. You bastard! You bastard! Uh, 
Okay. I got you. Is he bit? My dad. David, I couldn't fight him all, Hobby. Oh, no, no, no. I'm sorry. Okay, David, see. I knew it. <laughs> I'm not gonna say I told you so, okay. but. Okay. I got you, David. Don't go too far, Gabe. Jesus. This is how you get picked off, too. Put him out of his misery. Oh, okay. Did they get you? I, I, I'm fine. It just... It, it hurts. I tried to stop him, Javi. That's why we crashed. Aww. I'll go talk to him. Unless you want to. No, no. Can you? Please? Of course. Keep an eye out for the muertos. This is so sad. Hey, bro. I know we haven't seen eye to eye. Or neck to neck. But... <laughs> I don't think you're gonna make it. Can I just shoot you in the no face? that it takes everything to raise a child <coughs> I don't mean money or time or patience I mean everything when you give everything it's hard to know what to do when you lose everything Hey, you didn't lose anything. You freaked out and stole them. You did your best. Don't pretend to be a hero. You abandoned us. I know you were doing what you thought best, David. It's never an easy thing. <sighs> Gabe. Take care of him, Javi. You have to take care of each other. <sighs> you sound like Pa. I gave you my Please. word. Gabe doesn't need that. You know, Pa said the same thing about you and me. <laughs> he was a smart guy. Lousy domino player. But <laughs> he's not as bad as you. <gasps> oh. Uh, oh, oh, oh um, bye, David. Te quiero, Gabriel. Oh. Te quiero, Mariana. Te quiero, Javier. Aww, that's so sweet. Say it back, Javi. <gasps> oh, oh, God damn it, Javi. All right, uh, let's shoot him in the head so he doesn't become a mortos. I'll do it. Oh. Four. He turns. I don't have a gun with bullets, but I'm sure I'm gonna hand you my gun and act like there's bullets in it. That's not fair to it's you. I'll do it if you can. You sure? I'll do it if you can. He was my brother. And he was my father. I'm sure. Or I guess you can use a knife. Nope. Am I? Oh, I'm okay. I'm reloading. I was gonna call bullshit a little bit. Sorry. If I could have reloaded, why didn't I do that in the first place? It's like Lee all over again, except Lee broke my heart in two pieces. David we had a love-hate relationship with. Do it. Alright, well let's just hop out on my motorcycle and head back to the girls. Or, you know, maybe go in the opposite direction of our bike. That's fine. We'll walk. It's no biggie. Oh, nope. We took the truck. 
Yeah! Get him! There's a happy side. Hey! We gotta find Kate! Jesus! A man in my guide is Why did you run into the wall? I'm confused. I got in contact with my people, I headed right back. Had to make sure you folks were safe. Is he part Can of the kingdom now? Yeah, sure, not a problem. I just rammed into it. You gotta boost me up, Gabe. This seems like Gabe would be easier to <laughs> go up. I'll have it open in a second. I feel like something's gonna jump out at us. Um. Pull that lever again, Javier. Oh. Buttons. You always press buttons. Oh, shit. Are you trying to attract even more walkers? Kind no. of. Nope. Green button for go. Oh, green is go. Green is go, guys. Bingo. Let's get inside and wrangle the walkers together. If we get them in one group, we can lead them right out. But what about Kate and Clem? We need to round up these walkers! Kate? Kate, where are Head you? Towards the gate. What's going on? Hey! I can't find Kate! We got separated after we sealed the breach. We were going to open the gate, but... There were so many walkers. I barely made it through. No, I did. We have to find her. Help me look. Of course! Kate! 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 Kate, call out to me. Well, what happened with that? What's going on with those horses? Kate! What kind of witchcraft is this? At least take some down while you're looking, Javi. Kate, please. Kate, Kate, where are you? Kate, Clem, why is your hair sparkling? Kate. No. Don't break his heart. No, she's out there. I'm so scared. What have I done? No. No. This isn't fucking happening. Javi. What? What happened? I don't know, buddy. I can't find her. I can't stop looking. Okay, we lost you? someone Kate, already today. Kate, Kate, please. Kate, where the fuck are you? Should probably hold up in a building with Eleanor. Jesus. Dark victory. Achievement unlocked. We haven't found her for three days? We don't even have a picture of her, do we? Oh. Hey, we found a picture. Oh, may you rest in peace. That's sad. Maybe you should have stayed with her instead of going after me. Maybe she'd be okay. Do they find her body though? For sure, for sure. Maybe you wouldn't be. I was such an asshole to her, all the time. I'm she sorry, loved you, Gabe. Please. You had your moments. We're all Forget assholes. All that, buddy. She loved you. Plain and simple. I loved her too. I don't think I ever told her. No. But like he's gonna say no. I tried to stop him, Javi. That's why we hit the muertos. I thought that if we just went back, I thought I could save him. I thought I had to. You did the right thing. He was beyond saving. Dad, that wasn't your job. You don't deserve that guilt. You took a stand. You tried to do the right thing. He died because of it, Javi. Sometimes that's what happens. But that doesn't mean we stop trying. 
Mariana, Kate, Dad. I wonder which one of us will be up there next. Oh, no. Don't do that. That's jinxing us, Gabe. Bad karma. Bad juju. That's all that's left of them. Pieces of paper looking back at us, but never seeing us. What the hell are we supposed to do with that? Live, move forward, what honor them, stick together. Tell stories about them. Laugh at the jokes they used to tell. Keep living. Keep loving. Keep them in our hearts. Can you do that? Yeah, I can. Now hug and say you love each other. Or not, and be guys and walk away. I don't think for a second that Kate's gone, unless they found her body. Did they find her body? I'm very confused by this. And what would have happened if I went with Kate instead of Gabe? I know Gabe probably would have died, but how would we have found out? Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. At a high cost. I like on. you, Jesus. We could use you. I gotta admit, man. You're a fucking badass. You're a real charmer. You know that. Is he a replacement, Kate? Thrill. Rad armor, come on, stay. Are you really sure you don't want to stay? There's room. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure there is. But we got other people depending on us, Javi. Just the way it is. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be if you let it. Trust me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like junk. You gotta do the right thing. Always. I'll do it. Shortcuts work days, if I stay. Especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. Good to hear. I read people pretty well. Little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change. And I think you should. For the better. Uh, God uh, knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better Richmond. hands than it was. I was calling it Charleston earlier. I don't know why. Hey, uh, Jesus? Hey, uh, Gabe. <laughs> Thanks for, you know, not letting me get killed and for coming back to help us. Yeah. Thanks for that, man. Pay it forward. Like Starbucks? Oh. No. Trouble never Got stays it. too far away. Bye. So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ Hobby. I've waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? What is it, Clem? Anything for you? Second chances. Achievement unlocked. Oh, cutting her hair. I used to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought it was terrible. <laughs> That's life. nice. Shut up and cut my hair. Make your business. I'm really gonna miss Gabe. I mean, he's super annoying sometimes, but I've gotten used to having him around. I need my family here. Don't worry about Gabe. Dude's got a crush on you. Um, I need my family here. He is a total dork. I couldn't lose more of my family. Not with Kate. Gone. Hey, Javi. It's okay. You need him more than I do right now. Her hair looks cute short. I like it. I have to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. Do you think he remembers me? At He's still too little. young. How? Who could forget you? Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. Yeah, maybe. 
Everyone told he, us he was better off. You know, After everything that's happened. How he was cutting her hair. He would have right. stabbed her head like 15 times. I'm just going to put it out there. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop. You tried your best. Of course it. you were. You probably weren't. <laughs> Did you love him? With all of my heart. And of course you were. Okay, that's better. Now he's cutting her hair instead of jabbing her head. Nope, nope, he's back jabbing. I used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up, too. Eh, it's all in the past now. Can't do yep. anything about it. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? You just keep trying, lose it, loss gives you strength, I don't think if you can. You really loved it. How? You get back out there and find something better. There may not be something better out there. You won't know until you step outside. All done. Well, how's it look? <laughs> He's like, shit, I fucked it up. You know what? I'll grab your hat. <laughs> I think it's cute, Clem. <laughs> Remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, when you come back, I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. Oh, I love her haircut. It's so cute. If... I bring AJ back with me. Will you teach him too? Bring him back, leave him be. You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back. I bet she's gonna find Kenny too. Plot twist, Kenny actually has AJ. Oh, I like her outfit too. Look how grown up she looks. It's that period thing. Gabe, stop checking her out. She's getting ready to leave. Bye, Clem. See you in the next game. Miss you already. The dawn breaks. Wait, that's it? That's the end? <clears throat> your experience with David was heartfelt. You accepted David's hand after he punched you on the night your father died. You supported David's plans to meet at his house at Richmond. In his time of need, you distanced yourself from David. After David passed, Gabe shot him to prevent from turning. Your experience with Kate was mixed signals. That's because I was very mixed signaled with Kate to begin with. You were relieved to see Kate alive in the junkyard. You rejected Kate's plan to leave Richmond. You told Kate you wanted a future with her. After you saved Richmond, Kate was nowhere to be found. Okay, so she definitely didn't die. She was missing. So they haven't found a body. Your experience with Gabe was cautious. You upset Gabe by not staying in the trailer for the night. You hid the truth about Gabe's neighborhood friend. After David drove away with Gabe, you went after your nephew. You encouraged Gabe to honor the memories of those he lost. <clears throat> Bye, Trip. You reassured Chip by promising you wouldn't cause trouble in Prescott. Sorry, the music's really loud. Then you went to the junkyard with Trip. Finally, you picked Trip to live, but Joan shot him to teach you a lesson. You left Eleanor at Prescott when you went to the junkyard. <clears throat> then Eleanor informed Joan about your plan to save David. Ultimately, you did, um, did not forgive Eleanor for her betrayal. I am a very... I hold on to grudges, guys. I'm sorry. Ava. Clementine declined Ava's offer to meet with the new frontier. Then Ava helped you get away from the armory because you showed solidarity with David. In the end, despite your not picking her to live, Ava died saving you on an overpass. Oh, that's so sad. 
So does that mean Trip is gonna die either way? Uh, Clementine ignored Lingard's medical advice regarding AJ, then you gave Lingard a lethal injection, and Lingard told you AJ's location shortly before dying. You coached Francine through Conrad's poker game, then you, um, when Gabe threatened Conrad, you con um, convinced your nephew to lower his gun. Later, you shot Conrad in the tunnel after he threatened Gabe's life. Well, duh. When you met him, you trusted Jesus and didn't bind his hands. Then you promised Jesus to always be right thing in helping Richmond survive. Lastly, you promised Jesus you would help him lead or would help lead Richmond. You kept your mouth shut about Joan baited you about Mariana's death. You brought then you brought Max to expose Joan and to the Richmond Council. Currently, Joan's whereabouts are unknown. Oh, so they, they don't know definitely if she's gone or not. Okay, uh, Clint kicked you out of Richmond for stealing gas. Then you took Clint's deal and spared Joan's life. Finally, David shot Clint on stage after he agreed to Clint's deal. Why would he shoot Clint and not Joan? David, the one thing you could have done. Did you stand with David on the ledge? You and 92.9% .9 of players took the chance of David pushing you off. <clears throat> what did you say to David about Kate? You and 51.6%. 0.6% of players confessed your love for Kate. Uh, King cleaned about your relationship with Kate, denied having a relationship with Kate, but David didn't believe you, and 2.2% of players did nothing. That's interesting. Did you fight David back? You and 65.2% of players showed your love to David, even as he took his anger out on you. Did you go with Kate, or Gabe, or with Kate? Wow, only 38.5% went after Gabe. 61% went after Kate? What would happen if I went out with Kate? <sighs> Did Clementine come along with you? After your fight with David, Clementine followed her own plan, splitting up with you. Oh, there was a... There was a percentage of her staying? Splitting up with you and 54.2% of players. I didn't know that she could um, come with us. Well, I'm glad she's going after AJ. Oh, I what the hell? Your Clementine became spirited and assured. Sorry about that, guys. I had to clear my throat. Okay. Uh, when strat strategy, when strategy, when tragedy struck the Wellington community, Clementine had only seconds to grab her friend Kenny's hat. Her friend Kenny's hat. That doesn't make sense. Before she and AJ were forced back onto the road to fend for themselves. Her friend Kenny's hat. This is my friend Kenny's hat. Anyways. After circumstances forced her to join the new frontier, Clem didn't hesitate to use her resources for her own ends, leading to exile and a tearful farewell. When Javi and David fought at the water tower, Clem remembered a similar fight long ago. She took control of the situation by putting a gun to David's head, stopping the violence before it escalated. Once David took off in the truck with Gabe, Clem decided the best strategy would be to split up and help as many people as possible, confident in her own skills and Javier's ability to handle himself. I really want to know what other different Clementines you could have had. Oh. Get him, Clem! Get him! Yeah! Show him who's boss. Wait, where's she going? Wait. She looks so much older with her haircut. Get him. I also like how the song is matching up to the gunshots. I'm gonna find you, AJ. Get him! Clementine's story will continue. Aw, yay! <laughs> Meantime, why don't you play Batman? <laughs> not now. Maybe one day, but not now. If you liked Walking Dead, you'd like Batman. I'm not gonna argue that, though. Anyways, guys, this is the end of the episodes. All five of them. Overall, I am kind of happy with it. I at first was a little skeptical because I knew that Clementine wasn't the main character, but I do like her involvement and how um, you were a different family, I guess. I don't know. <clears throat> 
you got to play with Clementine a little bit, and it overall felt satisfying enough that you're like, oh, this is, you know, this is the new Clementine. You learned her background story and what happened to her life before all this happened. And, you know, it made, it like gave a good transition to the girl that we left at Wellington and the girl now. And I like, that's what I liked about it. Um, I wasn't, the only characters that I even gave a shit about was Clementine and Javier. I wasn't like over the moon with Kate. Um, David was an asshole. I liked Mariana and Gabe for the most part, but you know, they were just kids and stuff. But, um, yeah, so that, that's my feelings on this game and stuff. I'm a little sad to see it go, but not completely, because I am so excited that Clementine's story will continue. I, I love her new haircut. I love the direction it's going. She's going after AJ. I feel like Kenny's going to be back in there. I have a feeling Kate's going to end up appearing. It's not like she doesn't know where Javier is, so even if she did get separated and is hiding, she can find him. It's not that hard. And then I'm kind of wondering how much of a tide jump the next series is going to be or the next season, this is what, season three? So season four, what it's gonna be, if there's gonna be a little middle, like the 100 days or whatever it was in between one and two, and all that kind of stuff. Anyways, guys, leave your comments down below. Let me know what your thoughts about this game was. Let me know what other Clementines I could have, you know, grown. I I don't know, that really fascinated me. I didn't realize that that's like, my choices had an effect on how Clementine grew as a person. Did it start from season one? season two and then season three and that's all the like how I grew up Clementine did other people have different experiences I don't know but I think that would have been really cool if that was the case and that was a really good addition anyways guys I'm going to go if you like this video press that like button if you want to watch more of my videos press that subscribe button I make videos Monday through Thursday and sometimes on Friday and I'll talk to you guys later bye